Good day and welcome back to another World of Warcraft video. And in this video we're going to be taking a look at unearthed fragments and basically how you can get them and what you can do with them. So basically unearthed fragment coins are a new type of material. Well, they're currency but they appear in your bag and unearthed fragment coins can be found or obtained by clearing world events. So world events are not necessarily world quests, but they're a new kind of event that has been added into the Zaralek Caverns, and you'll be able to find them on your minimap and around the Zaralek Caverns as you play through the game. So if you take a look while you are looking at your map, you should see these little horns. Now these horns generally will have a little blue chest that's available, but sometimes they will actually also have a little purple chest available. So these events uh, usually have a timer for when they start so that you have an idea on, on when it's going to begin so you can get there. And these are usually co-op or kind of joint events. Essentially what will happen is, is you guys can play and perform the content with other players. Now it's actually engagement based. So for example, if you don't participate, if you're just in the area at the same time that the event's going on, you won't actually get rewards. You do have to actively participate. And if there's a purple chest that is on offer, you can be graded as well. So for example, if the purple chest is on offer, but I only do one specific thing, I'll be downgraded to a blue chest. So it's pretty straightforward uh, essentially kind of makes a lot of sense and so like in terms of these events obviously it's very important to partake in them and kind of join in enjoy it like ensure your participation and essentially just kind of make your way through the events so that you can kind of get your hands on essentially as many unearthed fragment coins as possible now the amount that drops will depend more on the chest than on your participation. Purple chests can drop up to eight uh, or even more, whereas the blue chests can drop up to two or three. So it's pretty good. You also get some other resources and obviously some reputation as well. So, you know, essentially it's pretty straightforward. Yeah, I think it's, it's a pretty, pretty straightforward kind of like you know system do the events and get the rewards the events themselves can range from anything i mean you see me on screen uh dousing the fire on a snail uh throwing things in a pot killing enemies uh there's plenty of like events that you can do and they all have different like objectives so it's quite nice and varied i think it's pretty good in that way so what can you do with unearthed fragment coins? Well, there's kind of three main things. So the first thing is you can use them to obtain Shadow Flame Crash chests. These chests are on offer from Spin Sower, uh, and basically you can speak to Spin Sower, who's the unearthed fragment coin exchange, and you can trade in the unearthed fragment coins for some Shadow Flame Crash chests. Now, he offers up to Drake chests, or she offers up to Drake, I can't tell. Um, they offer up to Drake crest chests. However, honestly speaking, you can source these from elsewhere. So I, as much as they are helpful, I just don't really see a point in them. The main thing you're going to want to get is coveted baubles. Now, coveted baubles have three purposes, a pet and two mounts. They're quite expensive as well, 100 coveted baubles for this pretty rad looking mammoth and another 400 coveted baubles for this not as rad looking ignis mana ray contraption creature there's also this pretty badass looking snail pet but yeah the i would say these are a better use of your time for the unearthed coin fragments than the drake chests based on my experience with obtaining drake flame crests it's not so difficult especially with mythic coming out uh, Mythic Plus coming out, the Raid coming out. I can't see there being a lack of sources for that, whereas specifically Coveted Baubles can only be obtained in this way. So that's it for me. 
nice quick easy video hopefully it's helped you guys out and yeah give me a shout if you need any more help otherwise i'll see you guys next time till then take care stay safe and bye